see you. Thank you. Come on, come on. I know you guys have a tuna fish sandwich. Give it up. Yeah. Can you speak well, Joe? Ooh. Oh, <laughs> Say, back in 1974, scientists who had been looking for a way to study humpbacks as individuals to learn more of, about a number of things. Danny. What? Turned their attention to this feature, and as they began... Oh, yeah, there's one right under us. Wow, look at that. Right underneath. Wow. Look <laughs> at that one sneak out of it. All individuals to that animal as our own fingerprints are to Look, he's coming up. Wow. And they started in 1974. <laughs> <laughs> one female who became the very first... Look at that one just hanging underneath, Joe. See, he's probably scratching his back. Still is. Over the years. Oh, 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 me. oh my god. At 11 o'clock, the other animal is up as well. So both sides of the boat. Oh, the other one. That's oh, good here. <laughs> Whoa! Nice wow. catch. So we might get a tail shot. Nope. I don't know what he's doing. A slap of the tail. He's getting ready to do something. I don't know what yet. Splash him. Oh. I might get a tail shot here. I just can't tell. Oh, that's an animal we know. That's an animal. Whoa! <laughs> Can jump right on them, guys. Maybe get a ride. Aerospace. I forget. I think he's been born in 2002. So he's a whale. Did you feel it? Did you feel the spray? What was that? That was just, that was from the whale. So salt was named not so much for the pattern on the underside of her tail, but it looks like someone took salt and sprinkled it all over her dorsal. She's got a lot of white on her dorsal. She's probably the most famous and most photographed humpback whale in the world. She's a big female who is a great-grandmother and herself a mother 12 times over. Maybe a tail shot from this individual, can't tell. This guy's doing a headstand. Why? Because he can. Humpback whales are able to do things like this because they have a long pectoral fin. 